Hi guys, it's me. I'm here. <laughs> I'm back. Um, I know it's been a little while since I posted a video and I'm kind of sorry for that because I missed you guys but I had a lot going on. Um, we launched the Falco Kids. Um, I have been uh, gearing up for the new school year even though this is our first year of schooling year round. We, I still kind of took um, one of my week breaks so that I could organize, reorganize our schoolroom and things like that. Um, I made a, a bit of changes lately, a good changes, really good changes that I'm going to share with you very soon. Um, I did have a few videos that were scheduled and ready to post and I just wasn't completely comfortable with them because I could just tell that I was in a mode of change and I didn't want to post things that were going to change like tomorrow. So... <laughs> So I went ahead and um, held off on those. We have also been gearing up for our first. Um, we are going to be, in, we're gonna get a booth uh, for the Falco kids and I'm really kind of excited about it and really a little bit stressed out about it because it's about four weeks away and you guys pretty much already know how I am. <laughs> um, I'm not looking for perfection, but I do want things to come together, and I know that they will, and I'm really, really super excited about it. The kids are going to be working the event with us, of course, because it is a family business. It is a kid business. Mommy, can I take a... Come say hi. Come say hi. Can I, can I, can I show them my um, house? Can you show... I'm making... Okay, so... This is the bed one. But say hello. Hi. Are you going to say? Okay. Hi. So, look at my creations. I took out these Jenga pieces. And then, pieces. I have You guys, it's been a lot of this. Little people, mom, the dad, the sister, and the little, the, what, there's only one little. But they're all family. They're all family. The clips I showed you earlier were just a little bit of what we've been doing lately. Yes, honey. <laughs> um, can you draw on these? Can you draw on them? No, ma'am. Please do not do that. So I took these out. I had these um, Jenga pieces for the game Jenga. And I had this. This came from like a puzzle set from Melissa and Doug. So I went ahead and put the Jenga pieces in here here because I figured they could build and things with them. Um, anyway, so it's been a lot of that going on. <laughs> that cute little munchkin right there. Yeah, she's been quite the wonderful handful. But um, anyway, like I said, we have been gearing up for the trade show. Um, we have been ordering t-shirts and we're trying to start... I don't know, guys. I guess like a little program, like for our Falco kids, um, to help us spread the word. So we've been kind of, I've been trying to get together like all the details of that, so I can send out information. So um, some of you have already sent me your emails um, that you're interested in being part of our our brand rep. Uh, program and we're really excited about that. I just needed to piece, you know, to get together all those pieces. I had a lot of um, freelance videos that I had deadlines for. It was just so much going on that then I got a little overwhelmed and had a little meltdown. <laughs> so I had to get myself back together. Got my room all cleared out, cleaned up, and organized. Um, we're going to be doing a campaign. Um, I guess it would be kind of like a marketing campaign. So Cameron and I have been discussing that. Brian and I have been discussing that. Um, it's going to be based on our Dream Big Dreams t-shirt. So I'm really excited about that. I'm just excited overall right now. <laughs> I'm excited. Um, I've got a new plan for history. Not a new plan, but just an addition to my plans for history. Come here, honey. <laughs> We've got lots of videos coming your way because um, we are finishing up our um, solar system unit, our space unit. So we've got videos. Where are you going? Have some paper. I'm going to draw something. You want some paper? Come here. Do that over here. Come here. <laughs> She's been so funny lately. Let me see you. Get it, girl. Get it. Way over here. Oh, no. Now you're being shy. She's... Go ahead. Go girl. Go girl. <laughs> She's been so cute lately. Hi honey. So cute! <laughs> 
So you guys, she's been a handful, but we've been getting things done. Um, I'll show you the teas that we got in. We're currently trying to figure out how many teas to order for the um, event. This is my first go around, you guys. I know I'm going to make lots of mistakes, but I'm trying to have a lot of fun with it. Yes? Can I have some paper I'm going to draw? Sure. These are some Falco teas. Um, like I said, we are gearing up for our event in less than four weeks. So um, I've got all my samples in and then... Yeah, I'm just working on some of the uh, marketing for the booth. I've got Wake Pray play salty create like the creator dream big dreams and hallelujah <laughs> um trying to find just trying to work on the branding we want to add um a little extra something to the inside of the tag and then also um like a little hem tag at the bottom and we're trying to make decisions on what we want that to look like so yeah so that's another part of the falco kids brand reps is we love to get you guys input and feedback so i'm working on that it's just been a lot really super excited about um the new school year so what I, what i ended up doing since this is our first year doing year round is like I said, we started about four or five weeks ago, moving over into the new um, grade level, but it, it ended up working out great for us because it, it was like just the right amount of time for me to have like, to prepare us for the beginning of school, kind of, sort of. Um, it was something that in the past, like you start with day one, and there's so many adjustments and changes that are made based on the new schedule, the new curriculum, or however you're doing curriculum, that I would get really discouraged in the very beginning. So this was perfect. So it's kind of like the summer session was our adjustment period. Um, I decided not to take any records during this time period, um, just to make sure that I could, um, that we adjusted well and then we weeded out what really wasn't going to work and that we kept what was really working really well. So we, even though we started about four or five weeks ago, I'm not going to start my records for the year until we start on Monday. So this Monday uh, we'll be ending our space unit. So we would have completed one unit during the summer session and then we are moving on to the new unit and I'm going to begin my new school year records that day. So far, I'm super happy. <laughs> I made small adjustments to my schoolroom, still getting things together for the studio space and figuring out how that's gonna work the best for us. Really excited about that because it's been a great addition. It's made us feel like we've kind of expanded the living space in our house. So I think that was a good move. Because a lot of times I just try different stuff until I see what works and what doesn't. And a lot of stuff doesn't work. <laughs> but sometimes things do and when they do, that's really exciting. Cameron's been doing a lot of tinkering, I guess, building. We've been talking about the design process. Um, this. So here we have this for Cameron's house when we're playing go for it and stuff. <laughs> we so. use these empty containers to build, right? Yeah. So he's been doing a lot of building and we've been talking about the design process, um, the engineering process. So this is one of his designs. So yeah, that's basically what I've been up to. We are still here. I just needed a moment, I <laughs> needed to breathe. Um, I think sometimes when you're a part of the social media world, YouTube world, all that other jazz, there's this pressure that you need to be there all the time and it just doesn't work well for me. <laughs> so sometimes I just kind of, I'm on the verge of burning out was trying to get ahead of that so I just needed a little break to get things in order because there was so much stuff going on so I have my rooms all organized now I am almost ready for our Falco kids show um, and I'm ready for our official I guess first day of the new year um, I'm really excited about the new year and the things that are gonna come you know with our family so yeah I just wanted to pop in really quickly and let you know that I'm here and that <laughs> Um, that there are going to be lots of videos to come because we've been doing so many fun things and you guys know I have lots of stuff to talk about so I'm back. <laughs>
Uh, one of the things that I got a little bit um, confused with is that you guys know I have two channels. Um, we have a vlog channel, a family vlog channel, and then I have this channel. Um, this channel is basically going to be my main channel, and then I'll have the other vlog channel. But I started to get a little bit confused about what type of information to put on which channel, and I think I've kind of figured that out. I'm not going to do too many um, vlog style necessarily um, videos on this channel because I vlog on that channel. Um, and I was starting to feel like there was way too much homeschool stuff on that channel But that's what we are and this is what we do. We're a homeschooling family and homeschool happens for us all the time so um, I'm a lot more comfortable just accepting the fact that lots of homeschool things are going to happen over on that vlog channel So if you want to see how um, a lot of our day-to-days happen with homeschool It's uh, you know in vlog style format. It's going to be over on that channel um, from Serena with Love and then on this channel here I'm gonna try to move towards doing more um, intentional uh, videos here so more sit down videos hopefully and more of the documentation of our homeschool I think I was starting to get away from that a little bit because I was trying to answer questions and things like that which is fine um, but I just want to make sure that when I'm answering questions I'm actually you know not coming up with them myself that I'm actually answering you know a lot of the questions that you guys have if you have any questions so i said all that to say what would you like to see um i have a long list of videos that i would like to make um for our documentation purposes and things i want to be a little bit more creative with but then i also want to make sure that i am answering your questions and helping you in any way that i possibly can so i would love to know what it is that you would like to see um, on this channel when I do make videos like that. I want to start getting into like I mentioned before making more videos about memory keeping for our family. I want to do more planning videos and things like that. So I definitely want to carve out time to do those because those are the videos that I really want to make. But I also want to um, make sure that I'm answering any questions. I just wanted to know what would you like to see. That way I'm making sure that when I you know am making a video for you guys, it's actually something that you want to see and not something that I think you might want to see. And then that way I can save my um, creative videos for something I really want to make that maybe isn't something that you guys would request. So yeah, what would you like to see? I actually am finishing up editing a couple of videos now to schedule to be posted next week. I've got a couple of curriculum videos, some routine videos coming up um stuff i want to remember and then i'm hopefully i'm making them uh, blah, 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 blah. whatever i'm rambling i just wanted to say hi i'm here and <laughs> i'm excited to see you guys again well you know kind of see you kind of sort of anyway you guys i will see you in our next video bye